be great if your company had a complete end-to-end -end picture of your recurring revenue processes, including customer engagement, order placement, fulfillment, and fully compliant with all financial requirements? In addition, end-to-end -end data and transaction transparency. We will show you how this is possible by connecting SAP's Order to Cash Solutions, BRIM, with SAP Revenue Accounting and Reporting. Integrating these systems allows for consistent data flow, improved collaboration among departments, and more accurate decision making. In this video, we will be exploring a simple subscription-based scenario and how SAP provides complete visibility throughout the entire business process. We will also be utilizing a variety of personas to show how SAP's natively integrated solution reduces the time, cost, and effort required to have an end-to-end -end visibility while simultaneously improving quality and cutting out needless extra steps for areas like reconciliation. Subscription-based businesses have consistently maintained long-term customer relationships while growing revenue regardless of their industry. Whether we're looking at utilities, insurance, high-tech, media, or even telco, A standard customer subscription scenario will walk through these four key steps. These are included but not limited to things like creating a subscription order with your customer, having a automatic corresponding revenue accounting contract created, managing the customer billing, and posting revenue to the general ledger. All of these steps in the order to cash process take place in one SAP platform. Let's start with a customer subscription that is already underway. In this scenario, we are looking at a subscription order where our customer, Johnny Jones, has purchased a subscription for a TV service. Now we can follow the entire process for the order to invoice to revenue. Here, as the sales manager, we have created the subscription order using the subscription order app. So for this order, we have already entered all of the relevant data, such as attaching the product chosen by the customer. We have set a duration for the contract. We will be working with a two-year subscription. We have selected a billing plan cycle, a monthly billing for all of the recurring values, and lastly, we have chosen the correct organizational areas for reporting purposes. When this order is saved, it also automatically creates a copy into a provider contract. By leveraging SAP, the users can capture, monitor, and manage all subscription orders, from the most simplest of scenarios to the most complex. In the back end, the system is also automatically creating a corresponding revenue accounting contract that coordinates with your original subscription order with the customer. Here, we're taking on the persona of the revenue manager, who has provided a work list of all of their revenue contracts using the Manage Revenue Contracts app. As a revenue manager, we can select one revenue contract and view all of the relevant revenue accounting information. You always have access to drill back to the original order, and you can also use this view to plan revenue on a subscription order based off of the time in which these performance obligations will be recognized. An important point to remember is while revenue is being recognized, there are still other operational processes that can take place. For example, when the customer invoice needs to be completed, a billing operations manager can go to the Display Billable Items app and create and send invoices. In SAP, the customer subscription contract generates billable items from the billing plans. When the invoice is created, it is also sent to the revenue accounting contract to update the revenue schedule and revenue postings. 
SAP provides clear and concise invoices and streamlined billing processes to enhance operational efficiency. So now let's open the Simulate Revenue Posting Run app to see how our revenue will be posted into the general ledger. You can use this application to check journal entries that will be created from the original subscription order you had with your customer. For example, we can see the journal entries for the invoice and revenue postings. If we filter the posting category, we can see different posting types take place. We have an invoice correction, receivable adjustments, recognized revenue, and unbilled revenue. There is additional flexibility with this tool to be able to have the contract selection for posting, simulation, and error handling. As a finance or sales executive, you may want to explore revenue from a variety of perspectives, including geography, product, or business unit to help you manage and improve performance. The disaggregation of a revenue report can help you do just that. And because it is fully integrated, you have drill through capabilities back to the subscription order with the customer or even the revenue accounting contract for any root cause analysis. These reports are so simple to use as you can drag and drop any other dimension and analyze your information deeper. So, to bring it all together, SAP BRIM is fully integrated into the end-to-end -end process for revenue accounting in SAP S4 HANA Private Cloud. The solution delivers great value in monetizing complex subscription scenarios and ensuring full compliance for all revenue streams that are being recognized. It automates revenue recognition for subscriptions through real-time updates from billing and other operational documents. Also, with the integrated reporting, you can view different levels of reports where you can easily analyze the financial performance of your business objects. As leaders in connecting revenue recognition to the order to cash process, Bramasol has helped many companies leverage the power of the unique solution set. Our customers rely on us to help provide a unique perspective with deep process and solution expertise, helping them transform their businesses. Let us help you ignite possible.